Hey guys, Ricardo here and welcome to another Blog Tech Tips. Now guys, I have here a Samsung laptop. I do not know if you can see the Samsung logo just here. But of course, this is a Samsung laptop. Alright, so I'm going to show you to fix the issue where your Samsung laptop is not powering up. Now, if for some reason your device usually comes on and it's not coming on, I'm going to show you some of the main tips that I usually use when a laptop is not coming on. This is written for um, Samsung in general, however, it does apply to other laptops as well. Alright, so the first thing guys, if your laptop is not coming on, that you should do is to go ahead and make sure that your device is charged. So go ahead and get your charging cable, it might be different for, um, for you. This is mine, so go ahead and you're going to make sure that you plug this in. Let me plug it in completely. Once you plug it in, guys, you should see, in some cases, a battery icon. If you see nothing on screen, do not worry. Sometimes nothing will come up on screen. And, of course, one of the things you can look out for is an indicator that your device is charging. Alright, so the indicator that your device is charging might be um, the battery icon as seen here with the charge symbol or just a battery. Um, similar to earlier with a time frame notice my battery is at 85% and of course it might also be a LED as seen um, here that shows that it's charging all right so of course look out for that um, as I said it might not show any physical um, charging on screen but the LED notification is the only thing that you might get all right now, if you plug it in and nothing happens, do not try anything. Give the um, laptop at least um, 30 minutes or more on charge, meaning that you'll give it enough time for the battery to get some charge. In some cases, the battery is completely depleted and due to that, it needs to be fully charged. And of course, that's what it's going to be trying to do now. All right. So if that doesn't work, another thing you can try, guys. Another thing you can try, guys, in case it's not pouring on, even after charging, are charging for a good while is to go ahead and locate your power button you're going to do a power cycle so go ahead and hold down the power button you're going to count to about 15 to 20 that are in other words we hold for about 15 to 20 seconds um, after you do that let go and then of course go ahead and press once so once you press once in most cases the device should start up and you just basically the power cycle sometimes the software is crash and it was not actually off but um, nothing was being shown on the display. Another thing to try, guys, is to check your adapter. Let's say that you um, your adapter might be different. Um, this is my Samsung um, adapter. Um, in some cases, this might be bad. So if you have a um, friend with a similar device, go ahead and change out the adapter totally, both the USB portion and the um, charger itself. Sometimes one or both might be at fault and of course the device is not getting a charge even though you have plugged it in. Um, if you um, can change one, you can try them um, one at a time by changing the brick first, then of course the USB cable. Sometimes the problem is the cable itself. So get a new adapter and try. Now of course with these modern um, adapters, sometimes you have two ports. So for example, mine is a USB type C port um, at the side here. There's um, one and two i think this one is the one that should be for charging it has a lightning indicator beside it I mean that's for charging if you're not getting in charge with this one switch to this one over here it might be that this one is at fault also if you have any peripherals attached meaning that if you have something else attached such as a dongle so this is a usb type c dongle sometimes you might have one of these connected then you have something that's drawing a lot of power connected to the usb hub remove any peripherals like these so simply remove it and then try to charge another thing to try as well guys your adapter might be the issue again um, if you're plugging it into a brick or something that extends a port try plugging it directly in the wall sometimes the port that you have it in is bad or of course not working and you do not realize so switch the port that you have these in or switch the outlet port so plug it somewhere else and of course, once you do all of these guys, chances are you should be able to find some of the major issues that's causing your laptop not to come on. All right, guys, if you have an older laptop with a removable battery, mine doesn't have a removable battery. Go ahead and remove the battery completely. Then go ahead and plug in the laptop and of course, try powering up. 
sometimes by removing the battery what's happening is that it gives it a fresh chance to start up without um, the battery inserted after it starts up you can um, turn off the device and then um, of course replace the battery and then try powering up again in some cases for older devices with um, removal batteries or if your device still supports that it should work or in some cases it might end up working and fix your device another thing to try guys sometimes the display is um, not working or the display is broken um, if you have a secondary uh, monitor um, I have one in the background here uh, make sure you hook that up uh, mine works by USB type C so go ahead and connect it to that monitor and of course try connecting uh, make sure the device is actually powered up and of course it should in some cases come on on the secondary display in that case it might just be that the main display on this thing is not working and of course it's not the fault of the laptop not coming on but the display is faulty Alright guys, I think I've covered um, all of the major um, situations involving your Samsung laptop where it might not be coming on. If you have any feedback, go ahead guys in the comment section. And as always guys, thank you for tuning in. Ricardo from Blog Tech Tips saying bye until next time. Bye guys.